have a child who is interested in the arts, or maybe you'd like to introduce your child to them. This may be just what they need. Don Eisenhower with Young Rembrandts of Metro Milwaukee joining us this morning. We're going to talk with him, hear more about the program. Coming up. Cool. All right, parents, listen up. This is pretty cool. Don Eisenhower with Young Rembrandts of Metro Milwaukee joining us this morning from the great village of Nominee of Falls, course, we were yeah. just saying. Uh, thanks for being here. This is, a, this is a neat idea. So tell us a little bit about getting kids into art, but it's a step-by-step -step process so it's not too much. Sure, sure. Well, first of all, I want to thank you guys on Real Milwaukee for all the positive things you're doing. There's a ton of them in Milwaukee. This happens to be one of them. Aww, but thanks. keep up the great work. We, the city needs it. The city's doing great things. That's awesome. So, yeah, Young Rembrandts, I've been there eight years. Um, it's a franchise and it's uh, we teach kids how to draw it's a step-by-step -step process but what we do is we break the drawings down into simple shapes okay. uh, shapes that the kids are familiar with triangles parallelograms rectangles circles so it's less intimidating and we go step by step a uh, little at a time so they can chew off a little bit as they go it makes it a lot easier for them to digest. Yeah, if you're not a natural artist, right. you're being... T Let's walk over here, too. Sure. Who did you bring along today? Just give us an idea. Of so today I have two of our uh, kids, Lola and Anna. Hi, guys. And they are actually from Wilson Stem in Wauwatosa and Burleigh Elementary in Brookfield. Uh, they've been with the program several years, so they're a couple of pros. Uh, cool. They're doing great work, and their teachers recommended them. All right, so what are they going to make today? So today what we're going to do is a baseball theme. Got to love the Brewers, but also got to give a shout-out to the Bucks. Yeah. Like right. you said, so many good things happen. It's, it's hard great to time in Milwaukee. But so what we're doing today, we don't have a lot of time, so we're simplifying it. Uh, a lot of times we do much more complex drawing. Okay. Today we're going to draw a baseball cap. And what kids do, we all draw the same thing. But the beauty of this program is then they all get to add their own individual personality or flair to their drawings and make it special for them. Okay. So we're going to draw a baseball cap. And what we do, as I said, we break drawings down into simple shapes. So girls, what we're going to do, we're going to start with a... Um, a half circle uh, or a horseshoe shape and we're going to start on the left side of our page and we're going to draw up and over past our guideline like that okay got a nice big half circle i love this because that would scare me yeah <laughs> just looking at that where do you start right, right? Where right. Do you start? okay so this is exactly step by step yep, exactly okay. so then the next thing we're going to draw this line here it's like a thin uh s shape so we're going to start on the left side and that's fine don't worry about that you're doing great um, and we're going to draw a thin S shape starting on the left side of the page. We're going to come down a little bit, back up and over, just like that. So a narrow S shape, and that's that part right there, that line. So now let me ask, where do you teach? Where, are they, where so, do they learn this? Uh, we are at schools all over the Metro Milwaukee area, um, from Whitefish Bay to Milwaukee to West Dallas to Wauwatosa to Brookfield cool. to Germantown, Sussex, you name it. We, into the schools. Like, into the schools. Yeah. We go to the elementary schools, uh, which is a nice part. So we take all our supplies, we take our nice. teacher, go in. Kids just have to show up yeah. in our classroom five minutes after the bell rings. They sit with us for an hour once a week. Wow. Um, and they learn and grow. And let's talk about, because the one thing would be becoming a better artist, but there's a way that this translates into other parts of school, right? Well, absolutely. I, I mean, um, you know, arts are, um, th there's no doubt, uh, it's been proven that arts are related, directly related to academic achievement and success in the school. Yeah. Uh, but the one thing that really attracted me to this, uh, having been an engineer for many years, <laughs> um, was the fact that... Uh, Kids grow creatively, and I believe firmly that we need creative workers in any walk of life yes. that you go into in the future. Things are changing so fast, technology is moving so fast, we need to have creative workers, and drawing helps with that creative mindset. Because the, the kids, even though we're all drawing the same thing, they see all they the see other it. drawings yeah. that kids are doing, and they see there's eight million ways to do the same right. thing and they're all good they're all different yeah exactly wonderful are right, you guys keep drawing yeah, thank so you so much young we rembrandts we're going to put your website in our website so people can go there for more information okay they're good you guys work on this we're out of time awesome. for now but okay. thank you thank, thank you ladies you. Thank did you. great we'll be right back uh -huh.